it's a great honour. I never thought that uh, this would happen to me. Um, you know, I, I came to, to Bangor Tech when I was 16 years of age. I did a YTS course here in electrical engineering and stuff and found out it wasn't the right thing for me, the right career move. And uh, through various jobs and being in America for a period in London, um, I discovered that I wanted to be an actor and now you know, 25 years after being here in tech, I'm here, you know, giving this fantastic honor and it's, it's amazing, really. It is, it's something that you, you have to keep, keep on going, you know, there's, they say that if you can't put up with rejection and disappointment, don't become an actor. And it's living through those times, really, uh, that keeps you going, you know, there's always, you're always chasing jobs, you're always up for interviews, auditions, it's a very competitive industry, but you have to have, a huge amount of self-belief and discipline and because you know there are other people who want the jobs so uh, but it's it's a great job and I've got no complaints it's uh, I'm doing something that I like doing so I'm a very fortunate person I'm doing a series called Stella uh, with written and created by Ruth Jones from Gavin and Stacey of course um, and other things and it's a comedy and um, it's my first real stab at doing comedy on, on TV and I'm really having a good time on it. You know, it's, I've done a lot of serious roles recently in the past two, three years, so it's nice to have the chance to do something funny. It's, um, it's amazing. You know, I have to say that working with Clint Eastwood was the highlight so far of my career. Um, it is, it's, it's like, you have to treat it like you're doing any other job. It might sound weird, but it's, it's absolutely true because, because if, if you become overwhelmed by it, it affects your work and your concentration, you become too nervous, whatever. So we're all people, we're all there for the same goal, to produce a good piece of work, and that's what we did. And um, yeah, Clint Eastwood was fantastic.